In this video, we will create this liquid animation that you see on the screen in After Effects. Here we are inside of After Effects, we create a new composition, we'll be using the settings, click OK, and we'll go to Rectangle tool right away, click and hold, we'll go to Ellipse tool, and make sure that you have fill color here and that you don't have stroke in order for it to work. While holding shift, we click and just drag like that so that we draw a circle shape. We'll press Ctrl Alt Home to center the anchor point, Ctrl Home to center this to the screen and we can turn on the title action save so that we can align this precisely. I'll just move it here. We can leave it on for now so we can duplicate this one. If I click on this, the anchor point is not centered yet so I'll press Ctrl Alt Home, Ctrl D to duplicate this and we can, we want to animate this so we'll press P for position set a keyframe here at the beginning and we'll go to two seconds so i'll type in two period enter so that we are exactly at two seconds set another keyframe and just while holding shift we can increase the y value so that we move it down we can close this one select all the keyframes press f9 to easy ease for a smoother animation and then we can pre-comp this so select both of this ctrl shift c to pre-compose this we can call this liquid, click OK, and then we'll go to FX and presets, type in Gaussian blur, double click to add, change the blurriness to 100, we'll go back to FX and presets, type in levels, double click to add as well, we'll change the channel to alpha, and then we can adjust the levels until it loses the blurriness so that we can take a look at our animation that's the type of look we are going for to give it a color we can go to fx and presets and type in gradient ramp double click to add and we'll change the start and end colors 